everyone welcome back to another video uh, today's video is just a short one uh, showing you uh, a brief guide on uh, how to install the enhanced versions for Gran Turismo 4 online public beta uh, so yeah let's just crack on and uh, get on with it Right then, so obviously the first thing we need to do is uh, download the mods. Uh, so I'll leave a link to this post in uh, in the description uh, by Sal89. But here are the two uh, downloads. So you just uh, left click there, click download. Uh, I'm not going to do that because I've already done it. And the same for Beta Enhance 2, which two different versions. So uh, it enhances it in different ways with each patch. So, right, so once you've got them downloaded, um, extract them, whichever one you want to use, which you might want to extract them both. Um, so we go in here, just uh, close that. This is Enhanced 2. Uh, so we just extract those. It won't take too long. That's one done. And I think this was just the enhanced, yeah. Close that. Extract. Okay. Right, so what I will say is, is don't use your original ISO the online public beta um just make a copy of it uh because then in case things do go wrong or you want to go back to the original version then you can um so let's first do uh have a look at the first one well i'll i'll show you uh how to do just the enhanced one because it's the same uh process for both anyway uh, so, you go into uh, here and you've got a readme.txt, which basically explains, uh, it tells you how to install it and everything in here, but I just thought I'd make a short video on it. Um, and it basically tells you uh, what tracks are replaced. All the city tracks are now reversed when you go to normal, you know, the swap round. And uh, there's a few extra tracks from uh from tourist trophy a few of the licenses uh las vegas drag strip um you know and stuff like that but anyway uh, you can read through and decide which one you'd rather do because each one's different so uh to patch the uh iso go into tools and run deltapatcher.exe and that will open your original file obviously is the iso file on the desktop so we go to there there it is open and then your patch obviously you just go to uh whichever one you're doing uh go into that folder tools and uh, you just click uh, this one you sh you won't need to do that uh, well you might do it depends upon which version you've got right so you just click open and the next thing is just click this cog here and uh, undo checksum validation then apply the patch and there we go that's patched Right, so you can close that now. And then you have this here. Now you can rename it uh, to anything you want. You know, you can rename it like N GT4 Enhanced or something, just so you know which one it is. And then uh, you could load that ISO up in your emulator 
or uh, put it on your PlayStation 2, on the hard drive, on a USB stick, or whatever method you use. Uh, we'll be doing another video uh, soon, which actually shows um, what is included in, in these patches. So uh, look out for that coming soon. Right, so that concludes today's video. Many thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button before you go. Click the little bell next to it to be notified next time I'm live streaming or when I upload new videos. If you like what I do, then please consider becoming a channel member. It helps out the channel massively and you get some custom emotes to use while I'm live streaming, access to videos one day early and access to some members only videos as well. Let's take it easy, stay safe, and I shall catch up with you soon. Bye for now. Thank mm -hmm. you.